Yeah, I'm going to edit that part out. Sacrifice of Hellfire. Uh... Just like the last game. Okay. Blood red jewel about the size of a fist. Dun dun dun. Okay. Whatever. Let's keep going. I don't know. <sighs> we got a red jewel. We ran away from a liquor. Zombies. Okay, we gotta be able to do something around here. Oh god. No! Get off me! Crap. Dead. Die. Ah. Uh. No. Leon, I thought you were supposed to have lock on in this game. God. This is how you aim in this game. This is how you aim. You guys seen that? I actually had to aim. Uh. Bing. What do we have? Do we have anything? In our box. Special kind of key is required. Great. Sweet. I'm looking for ammo. Eh, 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 ammo. Finding some ammo. Do, do, do. I can develop film here because I went to film school and know how to do that. Isn't this a... I wonder what this gem thing does. I don't know. But we need some shotgun shells. Our shotgun's kind of weak. To be honest. Hmm. Yeah, we got tons of room. Look at how much room we have. And I can even keep my stupid worthless knife with me. You know, I am making attempts on trying to stab people. It just never works. Doo 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 doo. The knob turns, but the door won't budge. It seems to be sealed on the other side. I want that, Jim. 
The God of the sun and the God of the moon, their gaze upon me. Okay, that's easy. Push puzzle. Dun, 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 dun. Eh. Eh. Eh, we'll leave you there. Okay, now we need to push you the other way. Doot doot. And go just a little bit. Okay. Now we need you to go. Yes. I am getting better with these horrible controls, guys. Look at this. Look at me push this. Normally, it would take me 10 minutes. Ugh. Push. I don't know what these gems do, but we need them for some reason. Give me that. Uh. <laughs> Ooh, it's called the Virgin Heart. That's pretty creepy. Ah, zombie. Leave me alone. Yes. <sighs> I made it to the star's office. There are various trophies. One of them reads Marksman's Contest. Crit winner. Chris Redfield. Yeah, not my game. Tch. You guys remember. <laughs> he couldn't even hit the tyrant. <coughs> A picture of the star's members. There's Wesker, I think. Where's Rebecca? She's not even in the picture. Okay, sure. We don't even like her. Ooh, what's this? I like how they hide stuff from me. Ooh, what's this? Bunch of medals. There isn't anything useful on the shelf. Ooh, what's this? What? A replica of the... Uh, it's a picture of a young man. There's a good chance, chance it's his bo her boyfriend. Who is that? Who's the young man? I want to know. Is that freaking... Uh, yeah, I didn't know Jill had a boyfriend. Apparently, Jill Valentine has a boyfriend, and it's not Chris Redfield. See that? That's her hat right there. They wrote her to have a boyfriend. You guys see that? Well, I mean, it's a good chance. I guess it could be like that Miku thing. I'm obsessed with my brother. The desk is disorganized and untidy. Yeah. It probably reflects its owner's personality. That's not very nice. Ew. Candy. I want the candy. Hell yeah. See, that's why it pays to look around, guys. <laughs> do do do. What's in here? 
like, yeah, I'll take this shotgun. Do 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 do. Uh, Chris's diary. August 8th. I talked to the chief today, but once again he refused to listen to me. I know for certain that Umbrella conducted T-virus research in that mansion. Anyone infected turns into a zombie. But the entire mansion went up in that explosion along with... What do you mean? I had all those things, like the slides, all those files. You remember that, guys? And he's now he's saying he doesn't have the evidence. What'd you do? Lose it, Chris? I lost it. Three-way with Jill and Rebecca. All right. Anyways, moving on. <laughs> and uh, along with the, any incriminating evidence, since Umbrella employs so many people in town, no one is willing to talk about it. The incident. It looks like I'm running out of options. August 17th. We've been re receiving a lot of strange reports. Ugh. We've been receiving a lot of local reports about strange monsters appearing at random throughout the city. This must be the work of Umbrella. You know, honestly, Chris, if I were you, I'd just leave. Move to Canada. Start a nice life. August 24th. With the help of Jill and Barry. Who the hell's Barry? Anyways. I finally obtained information vital to this case. Umbrella has begun research on the new G virus, a variation of the original T virus. Haven't they done enough damage already? Dun dun dun. We've talked it over and have decided to fly to the main Umbrella headquarters in Europe. I won't tell my sister about this trip because doing so could put her in danger. Please forgive me, Claire. But not telling her about the zombie apocalypse in Raccoon City won't put her in danger, Chris. Good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not going to find your brother here after all. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Claire. It's okay. I what is happening to this city? I can't believe what is happening to this city. I can't believe that you weren't in Resident Evil 6. I mean, they put Sherry Birkin in besides you. That makes sense. Um. I don't think there's anything else we need, really. She's over there looking through Chris's stuff. Yeah, we looked at that. Alright. <clears throat> I need this. Unicorn metal. Is there any pillar, um, bullets inside? I can't believe what is happening to this city. I can't believe you're repeating yourself. Um... Whatever, I guess. Let's go. God, I gotta run past that stupid liquor. No! Ugh, crap. Get off me. Spade, huh? Mm. 
You know what? Bang! <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh god, he's still moving! You're a bad zombie. Bye, zombie. Okay. <sighs> that was pretty cool, man. You guys see that? Creeped me out. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> God, they need to do that in the Walking Dead TV show. Like, maybe Glenn shoots a zombie with a shotgun. And cuts him in half, but he still kills him. And Maggie falls in love with me. Alright. Um. Let's get rid of our knife, I think. Zombie. Um, yeah, let's just the knife. I think we'll keep everything else. Maybe we should keep our health spray. Eh, it's the only thing we have right now. Bang. Okay. Did we look around here? Yeah, that room's locked. This is the room we came from. We went upstairs. Yeah, we're done in this area for now. Good. Zombie hands! I knew that was coming. I just knew it. No! Get off of me! Does it do damage? Better not. Okay. Let's kill this stupid thing. Liquor. Are you here? What? <laughs> Die, you stupid thing! God. Why won't this thing die? <laughs> die! Stupid alien thing. I would liked you. Okay, you're dead. Good. Alright, that locked. You run over here. <clears throat> do, do, do. I have a feeling I know where this coin goes. <clears throat> goes right here. <coughs> No?
To obtain the key, you need to open your heart. I will wait. Yeah, I will wait for the unicorn, the beautiful beast. That's this. Yay. <coughs> Sweet. Um, looks like a spade. Yep, we got the spade key. Spade. Okay. I want to go over here. And I want to see if we can get in that room where all the zombies were. And, like, I got scared. Well, I'm not as scared as I was before. I grew a pair, so to speak. Oh god! Get off of me! Stupid zombie! How will you die? God, I knew it, I knew it. Get off of me! Uh. You know, not going well, game. Not going well. Uh, come on. You're right next to him! All these, like, Super agents, and they can't even. Ugh. Die, stupid. Okay, you're dead. Come on, buddy. Bang! Okay. Alright. We killed them all, I think. I hope. I remember that password, I think. What's over here? I knew there was something over here. I just knew it. I could smell it. Uh, anything else? Anything else? I mean, I didn't really know about that second one. But, wait a minute. He's looking at something, isn't he? Hmm, I don't know. Two, two, three, six. Hell yeah, we got the shotgun shells. And something else. A map. Hey, at least well, now we have a police station map. <clears throat> Why is he looking there? You guys see that? He's like looking at something. What are you looking at, Leon? He's like, I'm gonna look at this dead zombie. It's like, cool. Alright. <clears throat> oh, I know you're alive, aren't you? You're just waiting for me to run up on you. Okay. <coughs> Excuse 
excuse me. Um. Die. Bad zombie. <sighs> Anything in these desks? No. Nothing in the desks. Nothing in my head. Nothing in my hands. Nothing in my heart. Do, do, do. What's that blue box right there? Anything? Or that green light? Is that something? this ooh a save ribbon so that's what he was looking at this whole time maybe I don't know <laughs> yay I'll take your ammo mr. dead cop Two doors. Uh, um, we can go this way, I guess. <coughs> Two herbs there. We must make mental note. Ooh, one there. Locked from the other side. Okay. Anything over here like ammo? What would be the point of this besides the herbs? I don't know. <clears throat> Hello. Okay. Okay, so that door is locked. We cleared out this room. We got shells. I think I just went the long way. You know what? I never explored down there. Let's go see what's down there. There was a zombie. Or, um, yeah, down here. I didn't go down here. Oh, this is the way I should have went. Oh well. Haha, -ha, you can't come and get me. Stupid zombies. Do do do. The raccoon police department looks expensive. It's like Buckingham Palace. But with zombies! Let's continue. Leon still hasn't been all crush boy yet. <clears throat> oh, sweet. I didn't even use that. Good. <coughs> you know, I'm just going to put these red gems away. And I'm going to, for now, 